Okay, let's call this video things that are useful. I had a little air compressor. One of those little things that plugs into a cigarette lighter. And the thing was, in my opinion, just about useless. And if you could get it to work, this part here didn't attach well to a bicycle tire. Um, I bought this thing probably in a Walmart, and it's a cheap little air gun, actually. Battery operated, kind of like an air drill. But this thing attaches very well to the... <laughs> Okay, where was we? This little end attaches well to the air valve on the bicycle and it has a pressure gauge built into the handle here so that you can mash that. It'll show you what the pressure is when you put the, I have that attached to the bicycle. It'll show you what the air pressure is um, in the tire and then if you hit the plus it will, as it pumps up, it'll go up to the number that you've selected with the plus and the minus so when it gets there it will stop. That's a pretty handy little device for keeping bicycle tires pumped up. Uh, Trish had a flat on her bike shortly after we got here. We tried to use that other pump and it wouldn't work. We tried to use the hand pump and it was almost useless. This little gizmo here works great and uh, in fact she's out riding her bike on the beach right now and we just pumped up her bike tires. Um, after I uh, did that I oiled the chain and I've got the chain oiled on mine and we're going to ride off to uh, a store, a nearby store here pretty soon. But uh, I just wanted to share that because it's like one of those little things that's proved to be helpful. I also bought this stuff which is called slide out dry lube but it's basically oil that is uh, goes on wet but then it gets dry like that. I'm thinking that would also make, if you could do it without getting it all over your bike, really good chain oil. So I set this up with my paper towel behind the chain, squirted some on both these chains, and so far that's looking like it's working out pretty good too. So just thought I'd share that.